In this video lecture, I will explain you complete designing of isolated footing design for the G plus 3 building structure by using StatPro V8 software. Initially, I will explain you the complete process of designing of isolated footing according to IS 456-2000 codal provision. Then after that, I will show you how to print that particular isolated footing design results uh, in PDF format from AutoCAD software. If you are new to our channel, please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates and civil engineering topics. So let's go to the lecture. So this is my model. I was already done the modeling process and I was applied the load cases for this particular structure. So initially I will show you the model. So click on the rendering view option. So this is the final rendering view for the particular structure. Okay. So I will show you the properties which is considered for the particular G plus 3 building structural model. Okay. So here I am selecting general option. Select the property option. So for this structure. I was consider the beam size which is approximately equal to 0 0.46 cross 0 0.3 and column size is 0 0.6 cross uh, 46 cross 0 0.46 dimensions and plate thickness will be consisting of approximately 0 0.15 uh, meter again in the same process I was taking the load cases which is considered only the gravity loading condition under this I was taking the dead loading condition system and the live loading condition system under the dead loading condition system I was taken the self weight of the structure and I was taken the wall load condition system and I was taken the slab load condition system in the same process I was taken the uh, floor load condition system which is comes under the live loading section so these are the load combinations which was generated according to the IS codal provision standard system which is the combination of 1.5 times of dead load plus live load and 1.2 times of uh, dead load plus live load and 1.5 times of dead load and 1.9 times of uh, dead load so these are the four combinations which we have to consider for uh, gravity loading condition system only so now i was already done the designing process also i will show you the designing results so here i am selecting uh, any one of the beam from this particular structure so you can double click on it click on the concrete design so that you can able to see the results which is consisting of the four bars of 10 mm diameter at the top reinforcement section which is provided at 430 mm center to center distance and bottom will be consisting of four bars of 10 mm diameter which is consisting of uh, 30 mm center to center distance you can print this particular designing results for individual beams also for that we have the option here like print option click on the print option so it will ask you to save the format so directly just i'm selecting ok option then after that it will ask you the name of the file just i'm selecting here as beam let us stick i'm giving the name as beam so click on ok option so that it will save the file to the single format pdf okay so i will show you the results so here i'm selecting my beam just i'm selecting here so now you can see this is the stat results which is consisting of individual beam reinforcement designing results okay so again in the same process you can save the results like column section design also so here i'm selecting the column concrete you can directly print on the click on the print option so you can click on ok option here so just i'm selecting column one here click on ok so that it will save the column designing results here so you can select here column now you can see this is the column designing results for the particular structure so these are the design load combinations and these are the designing results which we are considered for particular structure okay so this is the process of printing the results like beam and column for the structure in the same process i will explain you how to print the uh, isolated footing design results after the uh, designing in StatPro software so for that initially we need to design the isolated footing according to is codal provision standard system so for that we have to click on the foundation design on the top just i'm selecting foundation so these are the load cases and load combination which are considered in the designing of g plus 3 building so from this result just i'm selecting two load cases which is comes under the our regular loads like dead load condition system as well as the live loading condition system so click on the include option so click on the run start foundation software so that the fixed supports we are considered for the g plus 3 building structural model will be directly imported to stand foundation software in the stand foundation software we can easily design the foundation according to our specified load cases and according to our considered statements okay so here in this case example just i am taking the isolated footing design results for the g plus 3 building structural model so before designing that we need to check whether the node points are exist for this particular structure or not now we can see all the node points are exist for this particular structure of g plus 3 okay so after checking the node points we need to generate the load cases so for that just i'm selecting loads and factors here so click on the generate load combination here 
okay so initially we need to check uh, indian code as standard provision so click on the generate load combination so that initially it will generate the load combination which is comes under the service load combination again in the same process we have to click on the generate load combination for the ultimate load combination also so now you can see all the results are saved here so after that we have to uh, set up the isolated footing uh, according to our requirement so for that just i'm selecting the place mark here click on the create new job option so initially we need to give the job name just i'm giving it as one two three let us consider isolated footing so here design type will be consisting of us british indian australian canadian chinese so here in this case just i'm selecting indian and uh, default units will be of si system and uh, assigned to all supports so from this we are already generated this combinations right so we have to consider that combinations only next time selecting these combinations only which is of 101 102 103 it will be consisting of the 101 of one times of dead load plus one times of uh, live load okay so again in the same process it will be consisting of 0 0.8 uh, factor and 1.5 0 0.96 factor 1.2 etc so here i am including these combinations click on the create job so that the isolated footing job information will be open on the left hand side so you can click on this place mark again you can click on this place mark click on the concrete rebar value so here in this case we can enter the values of the particular concrete and rebar section if you are uh, familiar with these values otherwise you can directly click, keep it as constant value okay so but uh, in real time projects we have to consider the uh, our values okay so here unit weight of the concrete is 25 minimum spacing just i am taking here as uh, 50 instead of 50 just i'm taking here as 40 let us consider why because in foundation we will consider so strength of the concrete just i'm taking here as 30 grade m30 grade next i'm taking yield strength of the uh, steel so again in the same process just i'm taking uh, minimum bar size is uh, let us consider 12 mm size and maximum bar is to, uh, 36 mm so after selection of this concrete and rebar we have to click on the cover and soil type so just i'm selecting cover and soil type you have to enter the particular values again footing and geometry you can enter and sliding and overturning values so after entering all the values we have to click on the design option directly so click on s option so that the isolated footing design des results will be designed according to your is456 2000 codal provision standard system now you can see this is the is codal provision standard system value so you can click on any one of the foundation design so that the design results will be open here which is consisting of all the calculated values uh, in the calculated format okay it will directly calculate all the calculations if you manually do the designing results uh, sometime it will be comes under errors and uh, that's why we will get additional reinforcement value but that additional reinforcement values are not economical for the designing section okay so this is a starting page and this is a geometry this is a details and drawing and this is the gr drawing this is the calculation sheet for the particular structure so now i will explain you how to save this particular drawing to pdf format so for that just you have to select the detail and scheduling just click on save drawing as option so initially it will ask you to save the model just i am selecting as autocad file 2004 something like that you can select okay so i am selecting here as foundation isolated iso here click on save option so that the isolated footing will be saved in autocad format then after that in the same process just i am selecting as gr drawing option for the particular pdf so here i am selecting gr drawing save drawing as option in the same process just i'm giving the name as ga autocad file drawing option 2004 so click on ok option so that it will save in dwg file format now we have to edit that particular uh, saved files like uh, isolated footing and ga drawing according to our consideration just i'm selecting here as isolated footing so here my isolated footing design uh, results uh, are opening in autocad software then after that we can easily save the pdf for our requirement of the results so we have to click on continue to opening option so now you can see this is the drawing file which we are taken from the autocad software sorry stat pro software then after that uh, it will we have to save this particular uh, drawing file to pdf so before that we have to check whether it is having perfect results or not so now we can see this is the reinforcement design results for the column this is the uh, elevation view this is the plan view for this so here i am deleting this unwanted lines and sections so which we are taken from a uh, uh, stand software so these are not required for the lines according to our layout so here i am deleting these sections in the same process i am removing this 
content again i am removing this uh, drawing title name project name etc so you can provide in autocad software directly so here i am moving this particular section m enter option so here i am selecting all the plan view so here i am moving to the top section so here i am selecting the center of this again i am moving to near to this so again we have to move the note so just i am selecting here just i am selecting note here just i'm moving here like this okay now we have to click on z enter a enter option now you can see this is the foundation design so you can click on layout like layout one or layout two before that we have to change the color to some other color why because it will not visible perfectly in uh, autocad software uh, before selection so that's why just i'm selecting all this model so again i'm selecting here as a uh, white color in this uh, color index text so again we have to click on the layout two option so now you can see it will visible to you like this so we have to click on this uh, autocad or else you can directly save as uh, export as pdf option so you can export to the file like uh, isolated pdf like click on save option otherwise you can directly click on control p option so that it will save your pdf so now i will show you the reinforcement design results in pdf format so now we can see these are the reinforcement design results which is considered from the strat pro software and start for foundation design software in the pdf format okay in the same process we have to uh, do with the isolated footing design results of a gr drawing also this time selecting here as gr drawing so continue to open option here so we have to delete all unwanted sections so just i'm simply just i'm keeping the same file so just i'm entering z enter a enter option control a option so select your color uh, let us take just i'm taking here as white color so now i'm selecting layout two option so click on uh, autocad option export option pdf option so again i'm selecting ga pdf option here so that it will save the model so now i will show you the ga drawing also for this particular section so now i'm selecting ga drawing here now we can see this is a ga drawing for the particular structure it will be consisting of uh, like dimensions and uh, uh, beam res design results column design results dimension size of the column and isolated footing design results for this particular section okay so this is the complete process of designing of isolated footing design results and how to print the isolated footing design results and beam design results column design results in pdf format if you are having any queries about this video please try to text me your questions in the below comment box i will give you answer for that questions thank you